Uh, hi, good morning. Uh, my name is Rahul Gavai. Uh, so today we will see how to pan sharpening in RGIS Pro for Landsat uh, 8 images. Uh, before that, we have to need uh, download uh, images from uh, UHGS uh, site, uh, which is this one. And I have downloaded this uh, entire scene and uh, uh, we can download the uh, entire scene or we can download uh, band wise. Okay, if you click here, then it will be asked you which band you want. Okay, so mostly I'm interested only um, uh, band number two, three, four, five, and uh, uh, band number eight, which is uh, uh, pan chromatic band. Okay, so after download, then uh, you can find some information about the bands. And <clears throat> actually this is uh, 11 band in Landsat 8. And uh, I have downloaded this blue, green, red, NIR, and uh, this is band band, which is uh, 15 meter resolution and uh, rest of the, uh, which is 30 meter resolution. So I have to reduce the resolution uh, using this band 8 or we can improve the resolution uh, using uh, this uh, band band okay so uh, after we can open this all images in our jazz pro uh, i have opened this images in our jazz pro here and uh, before the uh, pan surfing we have to uh, uh, compose this uh, four band into um, one image okay this is individual band now you are combining all band together so we will use uh, uh, the analysis tab in uh, in the tools we will find the band composite uh, this one okay so we have to click here and here we have to input all band which is uh, um located in uh, contents so i would use this all band two three and four and the five okay so and this is my output folder name okay so let's click on run Okay, so after we have completed this uh, composite bands, so we can find here. So now my image is uh, in uh, the multi or in color. Okay, so I will off this in uh, other bands, and we can see this is the um, band. Uh, sorry, this is a band composite for this one. So now I am performing. Uh, and sharpening just right here then you have to use this one create pen uh, sharp raster data set and here we have to input raster so i will input raster which is the uh, just i have composite uh, band together this one okay so this one and uh, here we have to choose the uh, combination of uh, the band So it will automatic detect the uh, uh, bands. Okay, so no need to um, uh, select from drop down. Okay, so this is output, which is I will put as S H A R. Okay, and now we have to uh, input a pan chromatic image, which is um, uh, this one, band number eight. So I'll find the band number eight, which is this one. And this is uh, uh, the various method. Okay, so we will use this ESRI methods and okay, this is the weight. No need to uh, change this weight. Okay, just click on run. So this is almost done and uh, we can uh, see the difference between this, uh, uh, the band uh, combination here. So. Uh, so we'll find the we can uh, 
improve the uh, spatial resolution of this uh, images. If you, if you consider here, and this is previous image, and if you uh, see this, uh, the another image, which is we improved some some uh, special resolution. So, okay, so if you want to see the both the images, and you can swipe this one, so we can find here we can see the difference. It is not like huge depression, but we can. Uh, uh, improve the uh, special resolution of this uh, images okay uh, thank you very much